President Joe Biden has directed his administration to work urgently to ensure that infant formula is safe and available for families across the country during the Abbott Nutrition Voluntary Recall. ABC's Mona Kosar Abdi has the latest. This morning, the FDA is looking at ways to import more baby formula to ease the worsening shortage here in the U.S. with the possibility of loosening import restrictions. Ireland, the Netherlands and Chile are now identified as potential sources for more formula. We're going to work with manufacturers. We're going to import more uh, to expedite this as quickly as possible. President Biden Thursday said he spoke with manufacturers and the CEOs of Target and Walmart about ways to boost supplies. The out-of-stock rate for baby formula in the U.S. was more than 40 percent at the beginning of the month. My sister picked me up some in Arvada yesterday, my dad up in Thornton the other day. Ashley Lane in Colorado is one of the many moms struggling to find the formula her infant son needs. There was nothing left on the entire shelf. I took a picture and sent it home and I was like, thank goodness we have a couple cans left. When asked why the administration has not acted sooner, the White House said efforts had been underway for months. The steps the president took today are an acknowledgement and a recognition that more needs to be done, that we do not want parents, mothers, families out there to be stressed and worried about feeding their babies. This is not a third world country. This should never happen in the United States of America. The outcry is providing Republicans with another line of attacks against the Biden administration. Minority leader Mitch McConnell on the Senate floor yesterday read letters from worried parents. We've been struggling to get formula for our granddaughter for months now. The situation has turned dire. And now Texas Governor Greg Abbott is calling the Biden administration reckless for providing migrants at the border with baby formula. A Texas congresswoman tweeted this image of a shelf full of formula. She says the photo was taken at a processing center in McAllen, Texas. A representative from the Hope Border Institute responded saying, quote, these children, all children, deserve access to full life, including food, shelter and love. The shortage is blamed in part on a recall back in February. The affected plan in Michigan should come back online soon, but it could take up to 10 weeks for supplies to be restocked. Monaco Sarabdi, ABC News, New York.